Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. SpaceX is preparing to launch its second Starship integrated flight test in mid-November, pending regulatory approval. The company has been waiting for a launch license from the Federal Aviation Administration for several months, but it is now close to being approved. Last month, SpaceX expressed concerns over the delay in the Starship program due to stringent regulations. The company warned that the delay could impact NASA's Artemis program, which aims to return humans to the moon in the next few years. On SpaceX's end, the Starship vehicle is ready for flight after completing all the necessary pre-flight milestones. The FAA is currently conducting a final review of SpaceX's environmental assessment, and the company is hopeful that the launch license will be granted as soon as next week. I will give a link to the Starship launch stream at the end of this video. Just a few hours ago, SpaceX completed its 79th mission of the year with a record-breaking Falcon 9 booster. Four, three, two, one, ignition, and liftoff. Go Falcon, go Falcon. Vehicle is pitching downrange. The Starlink 6-26 mission, carrying 23 Starlink satellites, was launched from Space Launch Complex 40 in Florida. The first stage Falcon 9 booster for this Stage mission, B-1058, launched and landed successfully for a record 18th time. This makes B-1058 the most reused Falcon 9 booster in SpaceX's fleet. SpaceX has been continuously pushing the boundaries of rocket reusability, and B-1058's record-breaking 18th flight is a testament to the company's success in this area. Well, guys, that is it for now. I will be back with more updates in the next video.